Sorry. So these are so cool. I wanted to I wanted to ask you about these. First off, tell us who you are, and then what did you bring? Okay, so I'm Jason Cruz. I'm on Twitter at a pattern to print, and I'm just a 3D print hobbyist. So I just do all this for fun. Okay, so. I, I walked by, I saw these lithophanes here and all these bright colors, and it's kind of blowing my mind, because this is all 3D printed, right? Correct, it's completely 3D printed. Just with a regular FDM printer? Yes, correct. Okay, so let's start off, just explain to me, for the people who have never seen it, what a lithophane is in the first place. So what a lithophane is, is simply taking a, an image and turning it to grayscale, and it has thickness and thinness, so the thicker parts are dark and the thinner parts are light. So when you shine a light through it, you, you have a picture. Here, let's see. Oh, sure, yeah. I oh, you've got a light. Oh, I perfect. Light, yeah. so, I was just going to, like, hold it up. Yep, so, so let's see if we can get the... Uh, so this is a black and white. It's way too bright for this camera. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so that was a black and white image. You right. printed it with various thicknesses. Right. And so when the light goes through, it makes the image. Right. Okay, I got it. So, it, for a, so what I do is that for a color lithophane, I have cyan, magenta, and yellow, which is like a color copy machine or whatever, but instead of mixing the colors, they're in thin layers. So when the light shines through it, you have a multi-color print. So when you put it together, then you have colors. Now, now this one uh, doesn't turn out great because it's uh, it kind of abstract. Yeah. Right, but this one is done together. So this one will look better. That is so cool. So, I, if you don't mind, let me grab it. Yeah. And I want to show the people on video here. This is just white. It's got different thicknesses. <clears throat> and then we have these different colors on the back. But watch the transformation of the color from those kind of bizarre colors. To that that is insane so do you have this like documented online anywhere or anything yes yeah, so i worked with uh, lithophanemaker.com to take the uh the algorithm so you can take your photos there and turn it into the scl files of cyan yellow magenta and white and i also worked with printed solid so they have jesse filaments that are cyan magenta i think yellow bird and quarter white are the exact filaments that i use to get the color accuracy. So if somebody wanted to reproduce this, where would they? Where would their best place be to go and start looking? So, um, probably, like I said, lithophanemaker.com has the, uh, the, the, uh, the to trade the SEL files, but my YouTube channel, yeah. which is Pattern to Print, also has a, a long video that goes through all the steps, so you splice it correct so we can have all the correct Can I? Do you mind if I show your card on the go video? Go right ahead, go right ahead. All right. All right, folks, there it is. Find them to get more information on how to do these crazy, like absolutely full, rich color lithophanes on your FDM printer. You don't need multicolor, you don't need full color, just a standard printer. That is insane. All right, thank you so much for talking to me, man. You're welcome. The interview you just saw took place at Midwest Rep Rap Festival in Goshen, Indiana. Going on back there. Uh, be sure to check at our members area at make.co. There's actually a full tour of the event uploaded there. If it's not there yet, it'll be there soon. Uh, until next time, you know, see you then.